I'm not going to lie, I'd probably start running the other direction. I reckon I'd uh, get hold of Will Overman. Um, <laughs> yeah, some days in the morning there, early mornings on a, on, a, on a long event, he'll come in and he looks a bit like old Grizzly Adams. And old Grizzly Adams, he had a pet bloody uh, uh, grizzly bear. And I reckon because of that, he'd be quite good. He'd be able to tame those bears eh, and, and get them back to the zoo for you. So he's my man. <laughs> I'll definitely radio Louis because he's like seven feet tall and can just like intimidate them away. Uh, well, um, on a serious note, I'd say emergency services. Yeah. Um, but on a fun note, maybe David Edinburgh. Something similar actually happened to me with bears. I was working on the Whistler um, in Whistler on the Winter Olympic Games out in Callaghan country, which is where they do the cross country biathlon. And um, believe it or not, I was working with a young Jonesy. And it was Paralympics and it had got warm. The weather had warmed up really quickly. Um, spring had sprung and we weren't quite ready for that because the bears started waking up. Um, and literally got phone calls and radio calls from our staff saying that they had sighted bears. I think I would call the venue response though responder because they know about the facility and they may have been in the situation before if some un unforeseen event takes place and you do not want to be the next tiger king or carrot baskin you know <laughs> so <laughs> you do not want to be involved with the animals like that so it's the venue responder the first in the gyps. stormy anyone that's worked on spark events group stormy 100 percent because he just he uh, speaking when I was speaking about earlier about creativity, there's a man with just absolute creativity. Be like, right, okay, what we need to do is X, Y, Z. Usually when I got problems, mum's the one to call, but I don't know how much, uh, how, how useful she'd be in this situation. First off came to me was Ryan Jones. I'm not sure why, probably, <laughs> probably because he would be entertained by the situation and watching him deal with that would be entertaining for me. Um, but if it was like just what about the genie from Aladdin? Surely, surely he could instantly make that disappear. Perfect. So, I mean, some of these security guards that I worked with over the time are probably the size of those bears. So, I reckon they might be able to wrestle one or two. So, I reckon we'll uh, we'll give one of them a buzz and I'll run in the complete opposite direction. I'd say it was either going to be you or Louis because Louis got the height advantage. You're a big guy. You can ha you can handle black bears, can't you? 